Well, g'day everybody, and welcome back to House Flipper for episode number 16, I think. I think it might be 16. Feeling a little bit better um, than I was last time I did this. Um, we did a stream in between. Uh, you can see our money is currently sitting at 82,000. I streamed this one night and we just did a few jobs, a few odd jobs and stuff. I did get a little bit carried away just before the end of the stream and went and painted everything white here. I painted everything white, as you can see, and repaired all of the walls so that we have a blank canvas in our uh, in our office slash home. So I did that. Just uh, That was at the end of the stream that we did. We did a few jobs. We did some uh, HGTV jobs and um, some garden jobs, just a few little bits and pieces, and uh, built our balance up to uh, 82,000. But today is an exciting day because what we are doing today is we are heading back over to the connoisseur's house. We are going to finish the interior of this house off and, uh, and auction it off, which I'm pretty excited about. I think it was... I think in the last episode we actually came through and we did these uh, veggie gardens and stuff and got all that happening and I was arming and ahhing about uh, what to do about the outside of the house but we aren't going to do anything about it at all. What we are going to do is... Uh, oh, also, thank you very much to Patch because Patch said that in here we can actually make a change to the settings, and I'm trying to remember what he said. Eco light system, right here. If we click that, and we go back, look at that. There we go, so thank you so much to Patch for that. Um, all the lights are on. No turning on, no turning off, and you know what? I've seen so many people complain about that, and I've complained about it myself so many times. And that was all that we needed to do. So I appreciate that, Patch. Thank you so much for that, mate. Um, okay, so we are going to stick some furniture in here. I'm going to keep hold of this paint. Uh, I am going to keep hold of these four pots of paint and uh, the tiles and stuff until we have finished... Uh, moving this around now as you can see this is probably why they did it that way because now we are having frame rate issues so but to to be able to turn off and on lights as you so desire it'd be nice to have a little bit of a wiring diagram and be able to you know i mean i don't want to this this room is separate to that room technically for us so you really want to turn that light on and only turn this one on but unfortunately it counts it as the same room so it's another bit of a sucky thing so what we need to do is we need to throw some furniture in here now we don't have a lot of room in here um for a lot of furniture so the the first thing that i thought we might be able to do is um to probably put in some um uh, we'll go into furniture and we will go into, uh, we're probably going to put in, um, oh, look at some, some of this stuff is so cool, Bambino stuff. I love it. I love it. Look at all that. That's all really cool. I think this is all new stuff that was, uh, with the latest update. Check that baby chain station and everything in there. That's really, really, really cool. So what we want to do is we want to have a look at, uh, I'm guessing cupboards maybe. Uh, I want to do a TV cabinet, although, you know, something like that would probably work quite well as a TV cabinet as well. I'm not sure how high it sits, but we could probably utilize something like that. Uh, wooden hanging cabinet, bedside tables, um, small hanging cabinet, uh, mammals cabinet. What's that like? What could we do in a beige or a grassy? A pastel rose, brown coffee. Uh, I think brown coffee is what we've got our walls done in, isn't it? Let's have a squeeze at that. 
that might actually be quite nice sitting there, mightn't it? I'm not going to do a, um, I'm not sure whether I'm going to be able to fit a dining table in, but this could be our TV cabinet, couldn't it? Uh, wall, maybe up against that wall there, that might blend in really, really well. Again, I'll kind of put it in the center of the room, but, um, you know, not that it makes it, it just looks awkward with that stupid bloody window there. All right, uh, television. Let's uh, let's look for a television. Uh, back here, and we will go to electronic equipment, and we shall look for a television. Uh, let's see, wall-mounted TV or a TV. Let's put a TV in this one. Are you going to fit on there? You're not going to fit on there, are you? Well, that will well, fit over there, but you won't fit on there. That kind of sucks, doesn't it? Oh, spin it around would help. Uh, let's see. I thought that that would have fit on there, but it won't. So, all right. Well, this is this is a disaster already. It is a disaster already. Let's uh, let's purchase that anyway. We'll plonk you there. Um, that was a wait. What's the point in having a? What's the point in having one of those? There is no point at all, is there? Okay, what are we going to put our TV cabinet on? Let's go back. Let's go for uh, TV modern TV cabinet, TV corner cabinet. Let's just search. Oh, look at that. An old TV. I never knew that they had that in there. That is so good. Look at that. TV cabinet, Vera. How ugly is that? All right. Let's uh, throw this in a white, I think. I'm not sure what's going to go with this area. Oh, we've used, we've used cedar, I think, didn't we? We used cedar. Yes, we did. So we'll, we'll stick with cedar throw you there like that and then we can throw that tv on beautiful all right flip you around ah there you go television is on that's a little bit better let's sell this piece of crap there you go goodbye goodbye all right uh so we have a television in there now uh the cedar matches the cedar in the kitchen which is okay now we need to consider what type of couch we're going to put in here is she going to be an entertaining person i'm not sure i'm guessing as a single person although that's a little bit stereotypical isn't it that's me stereotyping uh let's see furniture into furniture into sofas a harper light colored sofa would be probably suit this area quite well i think uh, we would want to put that in a, we could go in a brown coffee, I think, for this one. Um, in regards to the legs, we would have cedar, obviously. Um, and we could throw a splash of maybe. Oh, that's not too bad, is it? Mm. Uh, let's see, that's pretty, that's pretty horrific. Stick to grey, we could go white. Although white seems a little... Mm, don't know. Why do they do that stupid stripe? That's not what we want on there. We want... Uh, I think we might go... I think we might go orange on both of those, to be honest. <coughs> Sorry about that. I am still getting over my issues uh, let's see let's just create a nice little area there and we might have enough room to if we sit him down there we'll throw a rug in we might have enough room here i think we might um i did get a suggestion from um, a couple of people on the comments to to throw in some stools there for eating and uh despite the fact that it's not a kind of a breakfast bench because breakfast benches usually have a hangover 
where the uh, bench extends out over here so you can get your legs under. But I think we might consider doing that instead of putting a little dining table in. So let's have a look at what we've got stool-wise. Uh, chairs. And the next thing is, are we going to have nice chairs or are they all going to be terrible? Uh, I kind of like these ones. If we did those in a... It's really... Mm, that looks kind of ugly, doesn't it? Uh, cedar legs and a dark grey. We could do black because that would actually work in with our kitchen really well, wouldn't it? So we might buy many of those and throw these in here. And as I said, I know that um, we'll put maybe four of those in two, three, and four. I know that it's not really a breakfast bench. Um, but I think we'll do it anyway. We'll sit those up against there like that. That'll be better. There we go. Tuck them in a little bit. Tuck them in. Uh, let's get it in the right spot. There we go. Uh, move that over there a little bit, I think. Move him over a tad. Move him over a tad. Just to even them up a little bit. All right, so that should be cool. No worries. All right, so that's got that in there. So that will count as the dining area, which means that gives us the opportunity to bring this back here a little and uh, possibly even put in a... Uh, what sort of... Uh, what sort of sofa was that? That was a Harper light covered colored sofa. Uh, if we went into armchairs, do we have a Harper light colored sofa armchair wise? No, it doesn't look like we do. A nice retro one would probably be pretty cool, wouldn't it? If we were to put that in in brown coffee with brown coffee. And, uh, yeah, black legs. One of those would actually be pretty cool. Uh, there we go. We could we could actually create just a nice little reading area down here as well, couldn't we? So let's have a look at what we've got bookshelf-wise. Uh, let's go into bookshelf. Search for those. They don't give us that many bookshelves, do they, in this game? Uh, vivid, light, brown coffee, and black. Let's maybe throw that over here. It's kind of a little, little reading area there. That, that chair, that armchair looks so small against that couch. It's stressing me out. It's stressing me out greatly. Um, hmm. Might call for some reconfiguration, mightn't it? Let's just grab that and throw that over there. Grab him and throw him over here like so. Uh, we shall grab that and throw that over there and we will change this up a little. Come on. That's about in the center of that window. Fling him around as well. Stick him in there. And I might uh, flip him. Put him up against that wall there. And throw another one. No, it's not working. Bring that up like that. Give it enough room there. All right, that should be okay. Grab that now and we'll throw that in there like that. I'm not overly sure this wall here is working in this color now. Although we could throw some... 
could throw a little bit of grey in here somewhere, couldn't we? That's not centred, is it? That television's not centred. Which is really annoying me now. Right there. That's, that's a little bit better. Why oh, won't let me turn it on? Huh. Let me turn it on before. All right. Uh, let's see. Bring him back a little bit now. Let's throw him in there. That bookshelf looks pretty horrific against that wall, doesn't it? Uh, and that stupid chair that looks tinsy. What other chairs do we have? What other lounge chairs do we have? Uh, let's see. Furniture, uh, chairs, desks, sofas, beds, armchairs. Mm, we need something a little bit better, don't we? Uh, the Van Dark Color. Uh, we can only do a dark color, but we could do that in gray, couldn't we? With cedar. What do you think that would look like? See, it kind of, kind of goes with that wall. Uh, no, maybe a green? A green wouldn't work too bad, would it? Okay, okay. And it kind of goes with that. Let's just get rid of this, because that was really disappointing. Uh, let's have a look at what rugs we can get. Um, back, uh, let's just go back to here and look for rug. Uh, we've got the lengthwise, we've got the oblong, we've got the single coloured rug there, which doesn't give us enough colour options. They really should have given us a, um, a better selection of stuff in here. I mean, it wouldn't have been hard for them to do those colours either, would it? Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool there. But what we want to do is maybe move it this way just a touch. Uh, yeah, probably. Oh, we're still kind of in the same spot, aren't we? Let's just move it across a bit there. Let's move this beast across to here. Like that. Okay, that should be okay. I think what we need to do, uh, let's see, let's close that. Let's go back to there. Let's go to paint. Oh, no, come on, we want paint. We want paint. Uh, we need something that's going to blend in with that... Uh, Sky blue, heavy green, pistachio green. <gasps> Give me some more colours. I wonder whether you can mod this game with different paint colours because that's a bit ridiculous, really. Oh, it's just not happening for me, guys. All right. Um, it's that armchair. Man, I'm losing some money on this, aren't I? And that there is bloody terrible. Okay. Hmm, it's going to be a tough one. All right. Okay, do we have a coffee table? Do we have a coffee table? We've got a rug yellow. Uh, furniture, beds, desks, sofas, tables. Um, they're more enormous wooden table, enormous dark wooden table. Inspire wooden coffee table. <laughs> Rustic coffee table. Elegant wooden coffee table in cedar. There we go. I'm happy with that. Okay, let's uh, get that about in the center there. Like that's not in center, is it? That's about center there, I think. No, it's not. Oh. All right, that's a little bit better. All right, so that's 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 okay. That's okay. 
We can put a couple of plants up. I would have liked to have put a bookshelf there, but like, we don't have that many options, do we? Uh, let's see, decorations. Plants. What have we got? One of those would be pretty nice. Maybe, ew. Ew. Don't want to do that. Uh, let's leave it in a let's leave it in a dark pot like that. Let's throw you over there. <coughs> Again, I apologise about that uh, cough. All right. Um, well, not much is happening for us here, is it really? Uh, we probably want to. We probably need to put some lights in here as well. Because these lights aren't enough to light up the lounge room. Again, it, it won't separate them. It won't separate them. So that's looking... That, that's, not, that's actually not looking too bad, is it? So um, what have we got in the way of pictures and paintings? We don't have a good... Uh, I am going to come in here and change... Um, I am going to come in here and add some... Uh, some other stuff at some point when I get it when I get an opportunity uh, You can add your own pictures and stuff. So I am going to do that so that we have a little bit more of a um, a Little bit more of an option there Let's buy that Do you think that's too I don't, I, I don't think that's too large. I don't think it's too large. I think that probably works in well. It's it's, it's not too bad because it kind of does have sort of pastely colours, doesn't it? Uh, let's see. Did I leave a light on in here? Yes, I did. Okay. I left the lights on in here. I'll turn those off. We had a little bit of light bleeding out of there as well. Okay, so that gives a little bit of colour to the room. We've got the uh, eating area there. That wall there is a little plain, so we might have a look at what other pictures that we do have that might fit up there and sort of suit it. Um, not many, because it's all actually pretty crap. Uh, let's do a medium. What size is a medium on that? No, let's do a large. And I'm only putting these ones up because they sort of work with the colours, so... There we go. Yeah, they definitely work with the colours. We've got the tones in there, um, despite despite uh, despite the uh, the more pastely tones being kind of down in these areas of the picture and the painting. Uh, it still kind of works in there as well. That stupid window needs to go, but it can't. Uh, let's do some more plants. Where are we? Plants. Uh, let's do something on the inside of the door there. Uh, what's that? How big is that? That kind of looks all right, doesn't it? We can throw that one there because she does love plants. Oh, the old people are going up. I don't want to make something that appeals to the old people. Um, I think that's probably, I think we might just get a vase. Uh, a vase or two, maybe a glass, one of those in Emerald Ocean, maybe. We'll throw that on there. We will grab um, something glass like that uh, also in... Well, we have a little bit of blue. We actually have a little bit of blue in the... Let's throw that there, like that. We actually have a little bit of blue in that, so that probably wouldn't be too bad. Uh, let's not put them there. Let's put them over here. Let's put that one in there. Let's grab that little bottle, and we'll throw that in there as well, maybe over in this corner, like that. Let's get a plant for the uh, coffee table. We should be able to get something like... Perhaps that. Uh, we could go a blue on that as well. Possibly. Yeah, I think we might go a blue on that. And we'll throw that in the middle of the coffee table there. Not an interior decorator. 
Hokey Pokey is more the interior de decorator than I am. So, let's throw him in there. All right, so that gives us that little bit. Uh, we need to throw a light in here as well. So, let's go back to there. Let's go back to uh, installations. Uh, we shall throw in a elegant light switch. We will buy one of those and throw it on here. Oh, there we go. That should be all right. And we shall get a... Uh, back to installations again. Uh, nope. Lamps. There we go. Uh, let's see. I think I'm just going to put down lights in. I know I use a lot of down lights, but I am actually a really big fan of, uh, I'm actually a really big fan of down lights. So probably want to put them around about one there and one perhaps there. Let's turn that on. It turns everything on, but that'll be all right. We can do that. All right, well, that's looking okay, isn't it? Uh, let's see if we can get a nice photo spot for that. I don't think we want to overdo it. I don't think we want to overdo the dressing on this bit. Uh, so let's try and get a photo of this one for starters. Let's go into the camera. We will snap a shot there. Beautiful new Go back into the store and uh, we need to do uh, some uh, decorations again and we need to do some plants and we need a herb pot. Uh, basil, mint and rosemary, thyme, basil and oregano or oregano as, uh, as my American friends call them. Okay, they can sit up against there or could they go on top there? They could go on top there where you get a little bit of... Yeah, that should be pretty good. All right, what else will we put on here? Uh, let's see, decorations. Go back, go back to decorations. Go to... Uh, no, other. Let's go into other. Uh, standing light color surfboard. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Firewood. We'll have to remember that for when we're doing our place up. <gasps> I didn't realize that they had uh, corner fireplaces in there. Just little electric fireplaces. That's pretty cool. Um, what have we got here? What have we got? I haven't scrolled through a lot of this stuff. I mean, I think we did it one episode. We, we scrolled through a little bit of it, but... Candles, whiteboard, sand timer... Uh, supplies, molding protection supplies, weapon, bathroom, uh, kitchen, no, that's just all cabinets, I think, cabinets and, uh, ovens and stuff like that by the looks of it, yeah, for kitchens, uh, let's see, accessories, accessories it might be, there you go. Whiskey glass, round teacup and saucer, round salad bowl. Uh, can we have one of these in white? Golden, black, in black, most definitely. Let's throw a salad bowl, this little uh, fruit bowl down there. Uh, what else do we need? Let's see. Um, maybe we could, uh, yeah, maybe we could actually move, oh, maybe we could move that fruit bowl over to this corner here, like so, and uh, maybe put out a place for two of these, perhaps. Uh, accessories, there, okay, uh, let's see, can we do this in a, a teal, a light blue, maybe, should we do it in a light blue, 
Let's just set out two of these from her. I should have bought many. Always make that mistake. I'll throw that out there. That'll be cool. Okay, let's get... Um, what else do we need? We need... Uh, that's a pastry fork. That's a spoon. Round teacup. We need some. Uh, we need some white plates, don't we? Uh, square flat dinner plate. Round flat dinner plate. Let's set it up for a round deep dinner plate in black. By many, we'll throw one there, and we will throw one in the middle of that. Lovely. Um, I'm not overly sure about that choice, that choice of blue, uh, blue placemat now. Uh, let's see, come on, there's got to be more. Uh, let's see, let's go back up here. Uh, where are we, where are we, where are we, round teacup. How many of those in black? by many. Oh, that's not too bad, is it? Ah, oh, there we go. We'll put one on there. We'll put one on there, ready for breakfast. Um, what else have we got? Let's see. Yeah, this dressing, this dressing is, uh, it's not, um, It's not overly me. Uh, let's put that on that side like that. And that one on there like that. Uh, do you think that blue works with the painting there? It kind of blends in with that stuff as well. So that's probably not too bad, to be honest. Okay, let's just throw a couple more accessories in. Um, we did have... Let's see, uh -huh, here we go, uh, we will get one of those, and we will buy one of those, what probably colours that, black and black, purchase one of those, and we shall spin it around there, and throw it in there, just want to dress it just a little bit, not too much, uh, I don't want to take away too much from the design, That might be okay. Uh, what else shall we have? Uh, let's see. Susan jar. A Susan jar. An Amando jar. A black lid? Or wood? We'll get wood, I think. Black glass. Buy many. Alright, we'll throw one. Two three uh, go back again yep all right perfect perfect uh, we won't throw a kettle on there and I don't think we really need anything else do we uh, blacky container glass hanging clock we could throw one of these in couldn't we with black and cedar could throw one of those on the wall up here that'd be nice so we can tell what time it is while we're cooking so we'll throw one of those i don't think i actually don't think that there's too much more there to do is there i don't want to as i said i don't want to overdo it sometimes you can sort of overdo these things and get a little bit excited about them Okay, beautiful, beautiful. All right, uh, okay, so the last thing that we want to do is maybe put a rug in here, a little bit of a runner, so a rug. Can we change the color of this? We can do it in gray. A nice running rug through there would be probably pretty cool like that and that'll blend in and that'll blend in with this carpet here as well that door <coughs> excuse me i uh, might have a sip of water actually
There we go. That's better. That door is um, not centre again, which is a bit of a pain in the butt. All right. So I think I think we are done here. I'm not going to put any curtains up or anything like that because, you know, half the time, people who buy houses want to do their own stuff that way in regards to that still not happy about those but we will accept it for now so let's head home oh let's turn this light off here you can see the uh you can see that the issue that it is having on frame rate so i'm guessing that's why you can't have those on or maybe it's just because i've been recording lots of episodes of stuff and i haven't rebooted my system for a few hours i'm not sure all right here we are Let's head back there. I just wanted to skip to daytime and we will auction this beast off. We will auction it off. Uh, let's have a look at what we've got gallery wise in our tablet. There we go. All right, so we've got uh, for this house here, we've got that. Uh, okay, all right, let's get into, uh, let's get into this auction. So here we go. This is it, guys. This is it. Uh, let's turn that off. There we go. All right, <laughs> we are done. We are done. Let's auction this house off. Let's sell. Sell. Put the house on auction. There you go. We we won't uh, we won't go to the garden contest. Uh, we've been working on the house for four hours fifty five minutes. Current budget is eighty grand, and we bought the house for one hundred and sixty one. So have we spent have we spent twenty grand on it? I think that's what it means. Let's see what happens with auctions. This woman she she's going to give us a good price for it. Come on, get up to eighty. Get up to eighty. We are at 80. Um, there are too many rooms for the old people. There is no negatives for her, which is really, really good. That's a $13,000 profit, which isn't really, isn't really enough. Let's see if we can negotiate. Uh, propose to increase the payment by... Let's say 20 grand. I haven't tried that. I haven't tried that. Let's see what she does. Uh, your offer is too low. I can sell you the house for 20 grand. Ah, uh, no, get lost. Bugger. Uh, all right, which means that we can... Uh, they offering us 99 grand... What? No, uh, hmm, okay, so we can't negotiate with anybody else, so we are going to have to take her offer, her original offer. Well, I'm a little bit disappointed about that. 13 grand isn't really much profit for all of that work, is it? Negative, there are too many rooms. We'll go and look for a, an apartment somewhere. Uh, we could refuse her offer and try and negotiate with them, or we could refuse her offer and put it back on auction later. Let's just accept it. I am not overly happy about that. Look at, look at what we've done, though. We did a lot of work on that. I, I'm, ha I'm happy with what we did. I'm just not overly happy with the price that I got on it. I think that that's actually pretty cool. What we might try and do at some point is um, just flip a house and not put any furniture in it at all and see what happens there. So, excellent saving files to portfolio. Let's go back to the uh, let's go back to our office and then we can call this an episode. This one's been going for about forty minutes now, so. There you go, guys. That's it. We have uh, flipped another house. 
and we are sitting on 161,000. So in the next episode, we're going to have to look at something else to flip. Um, we'll have to buy something to flip, and then we'll have to go and do some other jobs as well and uh, see if we can work our balance up that way. But uh, thank you very much for watching this one. If you liked it, please hit uh, like. If you haven't subscribed, I'm having a bit of a stretch. It was a late night streaming last night. If you uh, haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe and uh, share, share my videos around. Help attract people to the channel. I will see you next time on the next episode of House Flipper. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.